All these people were cheering for me. I had trumpets blaring at me. And right then, running past Mercy Home, I definitely felt like a hero. To run by Mercy and have kids cheering for you, saying, way to go, thanks a lot, it means the world to you. My favorite part was knowing that I wasn't in it alone, that I was part of something bigger. I met so many wonderful people. I felt such a great deal of support, and it's what really pushed me through. You really are invited into a new community of great folks. So the social aspect is amazing. I love the Mercy Home Heroes. They are a wonderful group of committed people, generosity of heart and spirit, who organize around a terrific event here in the city of Chicago. They run the marathon and they save lives in doing so. I worked with Katie for a couple of years, so kind of looked up to her as a mentor. I was Terry's advocate for two years, and we saw a lot of challenges together. When I decided to run for the Mercy Home team, I specifically decided to dedicate the race to Terry. She told me she was running, I told her I'd be there to cheer. Terry decided that he wanted to support me and run two miles of the marathon with me. I thought that mile that I told I would run with her would be the worst mile ever because I only trained two days. Well, a couple more miles turned into a lot more miles. Huge surprise to me, huge. I so admire his strength and determination, and some, it's something I aspire towards as well. Mercy Home has always challenged me personally to try to step outside your comfort zone, do something different. Try to challenge yourself. Being a Mercy Home hero, you're provided with so many things. The support, uh, the guidance, uh, the fun activities. Mercy Home provided us with an awesome training program. Running the Chicago Marathon for Mercy Home was my first marathon that I'd ever run. So I was really unsure what to do and what I needed to do. God, I don't think I'd ever run more than like an 8K before. During that training, you not only got to meet a ton of new faces, but also work on obtaining that goal. And you have people all around encouraging you getting you involved, getting to know you more. Mercy Home was essential in my success in crossing the finish line. The pasta dinner was out of this world. There were Italian chefs that came from restaurants all over the city. The room was just filled with the runners, all the teammates, their families. It's a time for you to hang out with your teammates and also carbo load on some of the most phenomenal Italian food you'll ever have. My favorite part for running for the Mercy Home Heroes had to be right around mile 16 is where they have the crowd and the bleachers. Let's hear it for all the Mercy Home Heroes out there. I got hugs all around, my name was announced. There are so many people holding up signs and banners and there's music playing. It's all kids out there cheering, all the employees and staff out there cheering. I really understood what this meant. It was such an awesome feeling because you get to see the place that you've worked so hard to support. And that boost just carried me for easily for the next six to eight miles. The victory party that Mercy Home hosts at Charity Village is absolutely fantastic. It was a meeting place for all my friends and family and it was just a really wonderful way to celebrate finishing with everyone I care about. My favorite part was the massage. I jumped on that table for like 10 to 15 minutes and it was absolutely wonderful. There's even a bike taxi who will take you from the finish line to Charity Village because at that point you don't really want to walk anymore. Mercy Home makes the fundraising part so easy. They give you all of the tools, a personal website which is incredibly user friendly. They gave me the information, they gave me thank you cards after the race. If you want to host an event or things like that, they're there to support you, provide you with materials about the home and so it was really simple. Mercy Home is a real home for the young people who are entrusted to our care. I definitely look at Mercy Home as a family. We provide a place for kids to feel safe. And once you start feeling safe, then you can begin to open up. And when that happens, then we can begin to help you heal. Dealing with family, emotionally, how to handle things. These are things that, that I still use today. These kids are on a journey. It's a marathon and it takes day after day of staying at things. 
and, and to keep working at things to develop the skills or the healing. And the marathon and the Mercy Hero program is a perfect analogy to what we're trying to do with the kids here. Not only does Mercy Home provide a really fun experience and a sense of community in running the marathon, but you'll also have the satisfaction of knowing that it's for young people of Chicago, which is, to me, an amazing cause. I know they're doing it for us, the youth of Mercy Home. Yeah, that feels good, knowing that we have those heroes.